Hi, I'm James, and in this video we are taking a look at the difference in H.265 or HVC playback on Intel's Skylake and Kaby Lake processors. So on the left we have a Core i3-6100U, and on the right we have a Core i3-7100U based on the newer Kaby Lake architecture. And we can see here that playing this very high bitrate um, HVC encoded video uh, we're getting much smoother playback on the KB Lake chip and also we are getting very low CPU usage um, just playing this in the default Windows 10 video player we're seeing around about 2 to 3 percent CPU usage on the KB Lake system as opposed to 50 60 percent CPU usage and jerky motion in the video on the uh, Sky Lake system this is a very demanding video, um, even playing it on my desktop system, which is an old Sandy Bridge E Xeon with 8 cores and a GeForce GTX 680. While it's smooth on that, I still see around about 60-70% to 70 CPU usage. Um, so we can see the partial acceleration in Sky Lake for uh, HEVEC is giving... Um, some improvement and probably if it was a lower bitrate video could play it smoothly however KB Lake is giving smooth performance with this because it has full decode um, and also is giving much lower CPU usage so even if we had a lower um, bitrate video we should see better battery life as well on the KB Lake based laptop just because lower CPU usage is going to mean you're drawing less power through the test as well. I hope you found this video useful. If you'd like to see more from us in the future, be sure to hit the subscribe button. We've got plenty more videos we're sure you'll enjoy as well, looking at gaming on other platforms. And support us on Patreon if you want to have your say on what we test in the future. Thanks for watching.